Christmas video with all of the baby. Well, I think I've got most of the babies here. Um, so yeah, before we change them or anything, I'm just gonna show you guys what they're wearing. So yeah, if I don't fall first. Oh, and I want to show you a little Christmas setup. I have the tree, and these are all the presents from me to the babies. Um, because why it's in the bassinet. I know that's probably so weird, is because uh, Little Miss June keeps wanting to open up. And then I've got their stockings hung right there. So, yeah, they're empty right now. But, here's little Ava Lynn. She's got a little reindeer outfit on. So cute, I love this on her. She's so cuddly with it too. With the matching headband. And over here, we have the, the twins. We have little Haley with her white headband and this onesie that says Santa's girl. That's what she's wearing. And then he, Heidi has on this big blue blow. I love this blue on her. It looks so cute. She looks precious in blue. Um, this is actually Haley's sleeper, but um, I put it on Heidi because Haley has this on. But yeah, on Christmas Eve, she'll be wearing hers and Haley will be wearing the blue one. But yeah, it says my first Christmas, which it is their first Christmas. And they're looking so cute. Look at the little Santa feet. <laughs> and then Leilani here has on a little snowman onesie. The little headband and her pacifier. And Sally Mae has on this little checkered outfit with the embroidery on the collar. Well, not the collar, but like right up around the collar and the black headband because I didn't really have another white one. But yeah, then we have June who is obviously very tired in her PJs, her Christmas PJs. Looking really cute with her matching headband. Then we have the only boy here, little Liam. He is wearing just this little Santa onesie. And the last baby, but not least, we have little Wilhelmina. She is wearing this little Santa sleeper. I thought it was newborn when I picked it up to put it on her last night, but it's three months, so it kind of swallows her whole. But I mean, it still is really cute on her. But today we are not going to be changing any. We are not going to be changing her. We are going to be changing Sally Mae because I haven't changed Sally Mae in a video in a long time. So yeah, but first I'm going to put you guys back. On the prop real quick once I get down there. she's going to be wearing. I'm going to put her into this little Christmas striped sleeper with a reindeer on it with a cute little green bow. So this is what she's going to wear. And I'll button it. So that's going to be really cute on her. Um, yeah. So that's what she's going to wear. And then we're also going to do a craft I'm going to show you guys how to get the splatter paint watercolor ornaments. So, if I can figure out how to get this unbuttoned. There we go. Okay. So, Sally Mae actually hasn't been in a video in a long time. There are, and I think it is good that she's in this video. So, yeah. And I already told you why the Christmas presents were, and the Christmas tree are in the bassinet. But 
why there are not a lot of presents is those are only the ones, like I said, that are from me. And so Santa usually brings the babies a lot of presents. So we'll see how many presents they get this year. The younger babies usually don't get a lot. Um, but like June and the other babies will get more. I don't know if there are, I don't have any presents from me to Liam. So I've got to get something for him because he's got to have a present too. And I'm pretty sure Sally Mae has one. It is really hard for me to keep up who has a present because, I don't know, it's just really hard. So I'm going to have to make sure Sally Mae has one too. Oh, it is just, she's so floppy. It is just very difficult to keep up. I know June has them. Some, she has a lot. Um, the Mystery Baby has a lot. Um, Wilhelmina has some. The Twins, I don't know if that, they don't have any from the tree, but they have... Um, I think Santa's going to bring them some stocking stuffer things, so that should be plenty for them because they're really little and there's not much to get them that they would really need or use. This is so cute on her. Um, and then, yeah, I think everyone, Leilani has a present, Ava Lynn has a present. Yeah, I think everybody but Liam and I think Sally Mae. I think I remember doing something for Sally Mae, but I'm not sure. But look at how cute she looks. Oh, she looks really cute. His headband does not stay on her head. I think she looks so precious in this. This is really cute on her. And since she, she's really long, this fits her really well. So she's looking very cute. I'm going to put her back in the crib, and then I'm going to move her outfit. And underneath this blanket, I have a puppy tab for, to do the craft on so we don't get anything anywhere. And I need to find my apron. Quick, oh my word, I have some bunch toys attached to it. Let me take those off real quick because I was, she loves to play with my apron strings, so I attached these to them. There we go. Okay, so got my apron, got my surface covered, and then here is everything I need. So I'm going to make sure you guys can see. Whoa. Yeah, I don't know if you can see my face. So, hold on. That's working out very well. to make sure you guys will be able to see everything that I'm doing. There we go. I think I think that'll be good. If I can get back. Okay. So, hopefully you guys can see. Let me push this back so I can get right here. Okay. So, you're going to want to have an apron. I'm just going to leave it untied so it covers my pants. You're going to want, you don't have to have a cup surface covered, but I recommend having a covered surface. You're going to want water. I just have my new baby bottle. Um, you're going to want some small paint brushes. You don't have to have more than one, but I just grabbed a couple different ones. Get a couple different splatters. Um, and you're going to need cardstock or watercolor paper. So yeah, and then you're going to need watercolors. You could also use regular paint, but this is a lot less messy, and I think it'll look just the same. So, yeah. And um, I'm not going to show you cut. I'm not going to show you me cutting them out because that it really won't work because they'll still be wet. But when the paper's dry, you could cut out as many different shapes in them as you want, and then you could just poke a hole in it and tie a string through it. Um, so, which you should know how to do. So, yeah. So, I'm going to do what, I'm going to do, like, red and green, and then I might do half. I might do it, we'll see. I'm going to leave the lid on because I can squirt it. Some in the blue and the purple, yellow. Yeah, there we go. I'm not going to use brown. I'm not going to use black. 
Okay. So, but I do. Just tap the brush. It will definitely get on your hands, so that's why I say a red apron. And cover your close up. And cover your surface because see it gets on everything when you spot paint. So that's what the red looks like. I act I really love spotter painting because I think it just looks so pretty and none will be the same because you don't know where the splatters are gonna go or how the splatter is going to turn out to look. I'm going to do some green. This brush is very stiff. And you don't have to do it evenly if you want some cut one color in one corner. or You don't have to do it everywhere, but I'm going to kind of do it like that. And also make sure you don't have your babies around because that would not be very good. I'm going to turn that into a glob because into like a dot because it kind of, my paintbrush hit. Okay, so there's that. I'm going to do some yellow, I think, because I think yellow might be pretty with it. I don't have a full one. I'm just gonna randomly do it like it's not there's not a solid bits of yellow like all over the page just in random little places okay and the video there will be a Christmas video of the babies opening their presents it may not be on christmas maybe a couple days after because the mystery baby is a kit so that it and she's got presents to open so it may not be like right on christmas but it definitely will be up sometime do yellow bear. I actually really like this so far. I think it'll be really pretty. I, I liked it better before I added the yellow, but it's still really pretty and you obviously cannot go back. I'm going to add some blue because I think that might be really pretty. I don't know if how well this brush, actually this brush does a really nice watercolor splat. It kind of looks very like primary colors, so I might, I'm definitely going to add some purple in there because it's like primary colors. And I don't really like, it's pretty, but it's like too primary for me. Okay. When the brush does like that, I just add globs of paint, like a big splatter to cover it up. I hate it when it does that. It's just like very frustrating. But can pretty much fix it. There we go. That doesn't look so bad. Actually, it kind of looks pretty. And then I'm going to do some purple. So I'm going to actually use this brush. I think it's a little too small. I don't know. Might be a little small. I'll definitely go and add more red because I feel like it, there's not enough red. And the blue is very much overpowering over the other colors. And this is Christmas. And this doesn't have to be Christmas, like, you could do, and you could make cards out of this, and you could write Merry Christmas on it, or, it doesn't have to be Christmas, this could be for any holiday, anything, 
crafty, just paper in general to make something out of. You could make, if you had some plain, a lot of paper, you could make wrapping paper like this. Because I know you can buy like lots of paper that's kind of like, I think you can buy plain white wrapping paper. I don't know. Probably. So I'm definitely going to add some more red. Ooh, that got my face. Okay. This is going to be very, very pretty. I didn't do any orange, but I feel if I did orange, it would be a little bit too much. I don't think you got any orange. Um, I think this is very pretty. Um, I might give it, I feel like it needs some more, maybe more blue. I don't know, I like blue, and I think blue is very, I don't know, I think it needs more blue. Because it has one big blue blotch there, but not a lot, and it doesn't have any other big blue blotches, so I'm going to do some other Washes. Oh, so there's gonna be a blotch. Let me make that a blotch. You can, you could just do circles, or you could like, when you cut it out, or you could do like different shapes, like a diamond or a star, or a present shape, or any shape you want. So I'm pretty sure this is done because I might make some more of this. Um, because I think this is really fun and really pretty. And yeah, I really, really like that. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please click like and subscribe and share with your friends. I will see you guys next time. Bye!